Hello, and welcome to a quick demonstration of the SODA data quality integration with the Alation Data Catalog. In this quick video, we're gonna be playing the role of a data steward who just received a notification that there's a data quality issue on one of the order tables. So what we can do is we can quickly go into Alation and search for the order table, land on it and see, okay, this is the one we want. And now that we're here, our eyes are immediately drawn to the deprecation. We can expand this and see, hey, Soda Cloud has identified data issues. Uh, see below for more information. Awesome. So looking down, I can see there's an overview. There's a monitor status as well as data level set monitors. So the monitor status is giving us a cursory overview. It's telling us that there are 12 data quality rules applied to this table. One of them is critical, zero of them warning, and that the other 11 are doing okay. Coming down, I can see the data set level monitors, and this is really neat because uh, SODA provides the capability to allow you to set table level data quality rules. So you can compare two columns with each other and so forth, right? And here we can see that uh, ship date should always be later than order date, that there's an error here. Well, before we go further, let's go investigate the column and see what we're seeing here. So let's go into ship date. And we can see, again, deprecation, which is coming from the table. And we can also come down here and see that the data quality rules and uh, metrics that are on this column are within spec, that everything looks good. So let's go into SODA and investigate a little bit further to see what's going on. Welcome to the SODA uh, cloud. Here we can see the rule that the ship date should always be later than the order date. Um, and we can see the specific rows uh, that are failing. So it's gonna help us with triaging and figuring out what's going on, as well as seeing, oh, here are the number of failures that have been happening over the past history. So it's a great way to get that context and know, oh, these are the rows, columns that have been failing. I can also go explore this data set further in SODA and see your standard data quality distribution, frequency, and a bunch of other great things and quickly add other data quality rules to this. Okay, so we're definitely experiencing some issues with values coming in and that they're inaccurate. So let's see if this is an upstream issue. With Alation's automatic lineage and SODA's data quality information, this is where the integration really shines. And I can see upstream that there's a products table and a customer's table that are feeding this orders table. And I can see that there's a deprecation on these as well. So with a simple click, I can come over here and see that the SODA has also identified a data quality issue there. So I can now go and reach out to the stewards of these tables and to IT and start saying, hey, we're seeing issues impacting the orders table and it's coming from these two tables. So now we're able to start getting to that root cause analysis. I could also generate this report from this upstream audit. I can also see that there's a BI report coming from the uh, orders table that is also going to be impacted. And something that's really powerful about Alation is it's going to automatically put a warning on this report so that anyone that comes in will see, hey, there's an issue coming from upstream uh, that's gonna impact the quality of this report. So anyone that is watching this is going to get that notification. In just a few minutes, we were able to find a table that we uh, saw where it was experiencing an issue to then uh, exploring in Alation, okay, is it at the column level? No, it's a table-wide issue. To then seeing with Alation's lineage that this issue is coming from upstream. And this is the power of combining a data quality tool like Soda uh, with the data catalog so that your end users are being notified and made aware of this is what's going on so that they can use the data with more confidence. Thank you.